It's me, Stevie Jackson. Welcome to my show. Hey, welcome back to the Stevie Jackson Show, where we're going to take a look at our next segment, which is a familiar segment to us, uh, Meet the People of the Bible. So our first guest, uh, we're going to be doing a, a guest each evening. Our first guest is Judah. So help me welcome Judah. Come on out, come on out. Judah, good to see you. Stevie, yeah, nice to see you. Thanks for coming on the show. Yeah, no, it's good to be here. Glad, so, to, be, glad to be so, here. So Judah... Uh, yeah. what's some things that have been going on in your life right now? Just fill us in. I wrote a new ass here. Yeah, yeah, got it. That was a new donkey just recently. And, uh, <laughs> and uh, it was quite the ride coming in. <laughs> quite the ride. It was. You know, it was. They don't make them like they used to, I'll tell you that. That's for sure. Yeah, yeah. That's yep. true. What, what color is your donkey? Well, it's brown, but it's one of those where you look at it a different light, it turns turns colors. Oh, yeah. Wow. It, 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 it's a it's a new breed. I don't oh. under, I don't understand the whole thing. Must Matt, be pretty expensive then. Well, yeah, yeah, it's definitely not not cheap. I mean, my dad always knew about how to you know uh, make animals you know striped or spotted and stuff like that, and so they 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 True. refined this. And now we've got uh, so did different colors. Did yeah. you? Did you breed this donkey yourself, oh, yeah. or did you buy oh, yeah. this? Donkey? Oh yeah, no, no, no. Well, yeah, no, definitely. We we've been breeding this kind of thing for oh, a long time. Okay. We're we're, really, we're working on Got new some stuff. All superior the time. genetics over there. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Talking about genetics, that's my family. Just superior. <laughs> all the time. Uh, you know, so so okay. so talking about genetics. Uh, yeah. You know, I've, I've got your your pedigree here. Um, yeah. You know, and pedigree. that's how I talk about the goats and. Uh, Sheep and the donkeys, I guess, but okay, okay. So, uh, maybe family tree. Family tree, yeah, yeah. So we'll we'll talk we'll talk family tree here. Okay, uh, yeah. that's that's my mistake. So we'll, we'll talk family tree. Uh, so we're looking at the family tree, and, and your father was was Jacob. Jacob, uh, also called Israel. Also called Israel. Yep. Yeah. Uh, and his father was Isaac. Isaac. Yeah. Uh, and then his father was Abraham. Abraham. <laughs> yeah. Abraham. So, so the great we, patriarch, the yes, great patriarch. So we've got quite the 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 family tree here. Yep. Um, oh yeah. That had to be some pressure knowing that there's this big family tree and this big calling. Uh, how'd you how'd you deal with that? Well, no, there's there's no doubt. Uh, and so many, uh, I have so many brothers and stuff like that. There was always competition between a lot of us, and you know how. Yeah, I mean. Yeah, I, 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 some of that I can't even talk about here. I mean, it just I understand, you know, a lot of I brothers understand. and a lot of half brothers, and and That's true. The, what the stories I could tell you. Yeah, let me tell you. Yeah. So, so while we're on this subject of brothers, I, I want to play a game with you, Judah. Okay. Yeah. Um, sure. So I'm gonna name a brother. Oh, okay. Yeah. And then you tell me the first word that comes oh. to your mind. All right. Okay. Yeah. All right. I just thought it'd be good. All right. Okay. All right. So, Reuben. Reuben. Uh, betrayal. Okay. Betrayal. Okay. Yeah. Simeon. Uh, knives and cruelty come to mind. Uh, <laughs> not going there, that's okay. great. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Levi. Levi. Uh, kind of part and parcel with Simeon, actually, but but then also not a terrible bad guy, but yeah. I mean, yeah. And these are all my actual brother brothers right there. Uh, yeah. That's true, that's yeah. true, yeah. yeah. Um, Benjamin. Uh, Benjamin must have been the good-looking one. Hey, he's certainly popular. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, left-handed. That's what I think. Left-handed. Left-handed. Left -handed. Left -handed okay. all, yeah, yeah, yeah. Their whole tribe is known for left-handed slingshot throwers. They can. That's true. They're amazing. Yeah. So, yeah. did you know I'm left-handed? So left-handed. Maybe I'm. So maybe there. trace that uh, back to uh, back to Benjamin. Of course, you said good-looking, so probably not. <laughs> <laughs> you know, Judah. I can't always kick you off the show. <laughs> oh, Stevie, I don't think so. I mean, so, I'm Judah. <laughs> well, this is true. This is true. Yeah. So, so our last brother, uh, Joseph. Yeah, Joseph. Uh, dreamer, but also dedicated, mm -hmm. full of faith. Okay. Uh, can't get him off track. Can't get him off track. Yeah. So, yeah. so let's get a little more serious here, Judah. You know, okay. I, I know yeah. the, the audience here, they... They want to know a little bit more about the Joseph story and, and what happened. We know there was some some really intense stuff that happened with your family. Fill us in on what you can. 
Yeah, uh, so the whole Joseph uh, story, uh, not my proudest moment. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, he was definitely a dreamer, uh, had these dreams, and he would, he would tell it to us. <laughs> but the arrogance sometimes, I mean, I mean, he was still basically a overgrown child, and the rest of us were older, and, uh, you know, it was just all about, you know, we're going to bow down, and he's going to rule over us, even over mom and dad, and, and yeah, I mean, that there was some jealousy that came up with that, sure. and, and uh, yeah, uh, like I said, it's not my proudest moment when we uh, decided to drop him into that pit, and we're discussing whether to kill him or not. I did advocate for let's sell him instead, but again, that's probably still not my proudest moment, yeah. but... At least we didn't we didn't kill him, and uh, the rest uh, ends up being part of God's plan, which is a little humbling to think about mm -hmm. that too. That God used our arrogance and our uh, efforts to shame, and yeah, it, but He still used mm -hmm. Joseph and us in the plan. So yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. That's there's certainly some really some really cool things that happen at. Kind of, there's no doubt. There, there's no doubt the way God ended up yeah. using us to save a lot of people from mm -hmm. famine, and mm -hmm. uh, and and I would say uh, definitely for some of us there was some good transformation, good change that happened because yeah. of everything that ended up happening. So I, I did a fair amount of growing up in the intervening years between mm -hmm. thinking Joseph was gone forever. And then finding them alive again. Yeah. So. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I I appreciate your honesty there, Judah, and, and I think the audience does too. Just uh, thanks for sharing some of your heart there, and, and yeah. it sure helps understand you a little bit more and understand Joseph a little bit more in the entire situation, and uh, just very helpful. So, Judah, I want to I want to talk a little bit about um, some things here that I, that I see see in the Bible. Okay. Um, yeah. Sure. So, specifically about your name. Oh yeah. Um, when you talk about Judah, there, mention the, the a lion is mentioned. True, all the time. So what what's going on there? Well, yes, uh, in scripture you're going to have to talk about. Uh, uh, I know for me specifically the blessing a lion's cub. Uh, there's the, I was talking about the lion of Judah. Uh, Judah ends up being the ruling tribe mm -hmm. where uh, the kings and 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 royal descent. Is going to come from mm -hmm. that tribe, and then that's that's me and my descendants, and that uh, again, that's that's humbling uh, because that's no more than God picked me mm -hmm. to be able to have that happen, yeah. and and uh, so yeah, that's that's there. I mean, the, the blessing that uh, Dad gave each of the sons, and the one he gave me uh, was one that. Uh, yes, pride. I've got some pride in that. Uh, humbling because I didn't deserve it. Uh, and then uh, how I think God's going to mm -hmm. use that to further his kingdom. That's yeah. that's how I would see it. Because yeah. the way I understand it here is is you actually, you got a, a blessing that was the firstborn blessing. Is that it's correct? It's usually reserved for the firstborn. And, but, and, but and you're not the firstborn. I'm not. Reuben is. But because of actions he did, dad wasn't ever going to be able to bless mm -hmm. him. And, and, and I stepped up, I had older brothers yet, but I stepped up mm -hmm. and God was able to, to bless that. Um, so yes, it is, it reads more like a firstborn blessing than it does a fifth born mm -hmm. person or whatever. Yeah. 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 So there's some, yeah. some interesting things that are happening there. Now, uh, there's also some things here that talks about, uh, until he to whom it belongs will come. Who are we talking about here? You know? That seems to be something in, in my future that there will come a, a ruler in, in this mm -hmm. line of rulers who is the ruler. And, the that, ruler. And, and that there will be no other ruler than this one. Okay. And this one will, will come. And, and uh, there's other prophecies in the Bible that, which would indicate that is happening yet too. So, uh, you know, I think we... Pay attention. We, we we look out there and and watch for this uh, anointed one from God that's going to come and, and rule everyone and and everybody flocks to yeah. that banner. So yeah. So there's more to come. There's more to come. That's and... not the end of the story yet. Yeah. That's for sure. Yeah. 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 Very good. So Judah, 
that is the end of our segment here today. I just want to thank you so much for coming on the show and telling us a little bit more about yourself, helping the audience understand who you are and, and telling your story. Uh, so let, let's go ahead and, and, and thank Judah for coming. Uh, he just did such a good job. And yeah, we'll, uh, we'll definitely want to have you on the show again, maybe talk a little bit more about that donkey that you have. And Yeah, you know, it's a special uh, one, yeah. But yeah. It, do you, have a, do you have a name for the company that, you know, is it a genetics company well, or a, a we're, farm? We're, or? Yeah, I, if I say that, then, then I've got people whispering in my ear that, that there's something called investments and stuff like that that mm. I have to be careful of. So I'm just trying to keep that all. Just keep kind everything of, kind of off the just, radar. Just all, and, off the secret. Not that I don't trust my brothers or anything sure. like that. Most of them. <laughs> <laughs> but... But, yeah. We don't no. want to get too much into that again. So yeah. anyway, no. uh, thanks for having me. Yep, we'll see you again. Dude.